Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So I posted a video about two weeks or so ago that Windows 11 version 22H2 this year's feature update could now be released in September as opposed to originally in October. And I'll leave a link in the description to that video if that would be of interest. But uh, just basically just to do a quick follow up to that video, it seems that this might actually be the case. And that's according to Zach Bowden from Windows Central who has now suggested that the first uh, feature and, and anniversary update for Windows 11 version 22H2 uh, could be rolling out by the 20th of September this year, 2022. So give or take, uh, that's just over a month away. And he's tweeted this on Twitter as saying that he's hearing that Microsoft plans to start rolling out Windows 11 version 22H2 on the 20th of September. And then on the Windows Central site, um, he's actually posted a post. And in that, he mentions that um, obviously Microsoft is yet to announce an official release date. But that he's heard uh, via and using his own contacts that the current plan general availability date is set for uh, September 20th. And he mentions that this date could still change. But that's what he's told um, that Microsoft is, is aiming for. Um, as of this uh, current moment and as of right now and the launch build as I have posted previously um, for version 22H2 will be uh, uh, Windows 11 build uh, 22621 which is currently uh, in the beta channel and also in final testing uh, in the uh, release preview channel and that same build also was released to manufacturing RTM um, I think that was back on the 24th of May, as I did mention in that previous video, which I said I would leave a link to in the description. So although not confirmed by Microsoft, um, uh, Zach Bowden from Windows Central says his contacts are saying that Microsoft is going to make general, uh, general availability um, for the feature update for Windows 11 22H2 on the 20th of September. Now, in case you're interested, um, just to do a quick recap of some of the key highlights, uh, that will be rolling out with that uh, first feature update for Windows 11, scheduled now um, and suggested to be the 20th of September. And this is by no means a comprehensive list, but in case you're interested, um, there's going to be app folders in the start menu, as I have posted previously, where you will be able to create a, st a start menu folders. Um, resizable pinned area in the start menu, so basically your recommended and your pinned sections will be resizable. Um, you're going to have drag and drop uh, to um, apps and um, the file explorer on the taskbar, which is a highly um, anticipated feature by a lot of users. There's going to be focus assist integration with notific the notification center. There's going to be a new voice access accessibility feature, new live captions accessibility feature. So that's two new accessibility features rolling out in version 22H2. Uh, new gestures and, and animations for uh, touch screen users. New sn uh, snap layouts, uh, a new snap layouts bar when moving the app windows around. And then as I have also posted quite in depth, um, there's going to be a new task manager app rolling out. And then as mentioned, another uh, key highlight would be tabs. Um, there's going to be tabs made available and tab support in the file explorer. And then also OneDrive integration. Um, it's also going to be available now and supported in the file explorer. And then there's going to be numerous other user interface tweaks and improvements and consist, consist, consistency updates. So that's it. Um, the 20th of September could be that initial release date now for Windows version 22H2. And if anything does change or any more information comes to light, I will post accordingly. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.